Alright. So, <laughs> we pretty much killed the dog. We got lightning from our hands. I think we're wizards. I, I can't really put my finger on it. But hello, welcome back to Tales of Graces F. This is Wiggly Master 102. And uh, as you saw last time, we um, we've grown up. We're doing our we did our first field mission. We went ahead and uh, basically uh, investigated the town of Ruin at the moment. It's not really much now, but we basically investigated the town that's been destroyed by. A, seeping hint of fire and animals and stuff but anyway I just one shot it in and that that was from our childhood <laughs> just realized that let's keep moving there we go get rid of that guy but yeah <clears throat> so yeah basically we did a lot of stuff last episode and um, check my titles actually. Okay, so you're good, and uh, you're okay too. I'm using apple seed. Mm, apple seeds, apple sauce, apple sauce, and apple seeds are good. Uh, I'm gonna save the sa the saffron and the sage actually because uh, or the, all our herbs at the moment because I'm gonna wait till a later point in the game where I'm gonna need to boost everyone's stats. So those things will come in use a little bit later on. We'll do an episode where I give everybody treats for being awesome. It's like giving people dog treats. Okay. Anyway. <sighs> what is there to do here? Aside from talking to that guy, we've, which we've already done, we don't really need to do much. We do need to get out of here, though. Which we can do just that. Remember your training. Okay. Sorry if last episode I didn't really talk much. <coughs> it's just like, uh, we won't fail. Crazy stuff. <laughs> That's all I can really say. Crazy stuff happened. Very crazy, crazy stuff. All right, let's get out of here. I think the mission went well, but how are you feeling? I feel great, sir. In fact, I'd like to take the lead until we return to the academy. It's good to see such motivation, but before you can lead, you'll need this map. Thank you, Captain. The road leads straight there, so I doubt you'll get lost, but it's good to have just in case. Now be aware of yourself, and don't let your guard down until we reach Barona. The monsters on this road have been fierce lately. Yes, sir! Indeed, that we can. Yeah, later on that world map will also come in use with a, another part of the game. But like I said, there isn't really much to talk about. Because we're not at that point in the game yet. It's, like, it's gonna be a while from now, that's for sure. This is what happens when you here. misjudge your foe. Stupid animals. Holy crap. It's it's one of the dudes from the Ninja Turtles. No, I'm kidding, but freaking warthogs, man. What are they called anyway? Oh, it's just a boy. It will take more than that to stand in our way. Freaking boars. <laughs> I'm mistaking them for warthogs like a dumbass. Discovery points. Mm, tea leaves. This area hasn't changed much either. If you don't mind me asking, Captain, who were those knights back in Orlet? Former students. I can tell they really trust and admire you. Forgive me for asking, sir, but why did you become an instructor? Surely you'd see more action if you served in the field. The other knights were more capable. But Captain, you're an exceptional knight. I can't imagine anyone being better than you. Flattery will get you everywhere, Asbel. But let's just say the others have a certain something I don't. Hmm. I wonder if I have that certain something to become a knight. Huh. <laughs> 
Uh. Mm, apples. Lots of apples. Oh, look at that. You want to get as much experience as well, too. Because, uh... <clears throat> This game will get a little bit difficult if your characters are under level. So, try to get as much experience as you can. I think we're at a good level, though. Heavily decent, at least. Yep, we're good. Let's rest here for a bit. Yes, sir. Seeing country like this makes you realize just how blessed Windor truly is. Remind me, Asbel, when did you enter the Knight Academy? It's been almost seven years now, sir. <laughs> it all passes so quickly. It's been my honor to learn from you during this time, Captain. You're the son of a lord, yes? Will you ever return home and reclaim the family name? Well... I ask because I'm ready to recommend you as a full-fledged knight. Uh, really? In truth, my word is a mere formality. If the life of a knight is your wish, your acceptance is almost... You're young yet and still lack experience. But this mission has convinced me that you're ready enough to take the next step. Thank you, sir. But this is not a decision to be made in haste, Asbel. Perhaps you should consult with your parents. That won't be necessary, Captain. I am prepared to devote my life to the Knights. Very well. If that is your wish. It is, sir. Finally! My lifelong dream is about to come true! When we get back, we'll make a little detour to mark the occasion. I assume you're familiar with tactics, right? It's your favorite pub, sir. Even a knight needs to unwind now and again. Wouldn't you agree? Thank you, Captain. I must say, Windor is such a beautiful country. But unfortunately, the wars never end. Where did that come from? When I was young and naive, I came here with a group of very close friends. One of them stood right here, and told me all about how he wanted to create a world without conflict. Huh. Back then, I was just a kid with my head in the clouds. At that moment, I believed I actually had the power to make his dream come true. That's what everyone thinks when they're young. But something happened soon afterward. Something that made me realize what a pathetic child I actually was. I see. And I assume that's when you decided to enlist in the Knight Academy. Yes, sir. Alright. So after all that, we're going to go ahead and head to Barona. So let's go ahead and do just that. Was hardly worth Get rid of these guys blade. first. Because that's what we all have to do. Alright. Off to Barona we get. Oh, hello. Get this chest while we're at it. Which is just a little Remember apple gel training. and a chicken. Okay, or chirpy, I should say. Chirpy chickens. Oh, look at that. That rock lance. Ow! You're pecking me to death. To get out of here. There'll be no need for that, thank you very much. Then I'll get rid of you, douchebags. Oh, wow. Clocked him with a photon burst. Not bad, don't you think? And one attack will get rid of you. Alright. <sighs> what is there to talk about? Nothing really at all. Let's get this underway. We also gotta remember that Kitty mentioned was also the very same Prince Richard. Victory is ours. I love that he smacked me and he still died. It's weird. 
<laughs> and it looks like Malak learned Photon Burst Adept, which we can uh, equip on him after to make his Photon Burst hit harder. Which is really handy. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and save. Because that's what all the cool people do. They save their games before anything happens. There isn't really much other going on about uh, with this part, other than the fact we're going to go ahead and get ourselves a nice drink after all that. Oh. <laughs> going the wrong direction, that's what I'm doing. Ugh. So bad at remembering where everything was. Now that we're older, though. Pretty cool kid as when we're older. Learn about lots of things. Oh, jeez, I am going the wrong way. Holy crap. I am so bad at remembering stuff. What the heck is wrong with me? Stupid person. Wake up, man, wake up. Let's go to Lower City, because that's where the bar is. Yeah, keep in mind when you press the uh, L1 button, <clears throat> it will tell you where you need to go next. Sometimes it doesn't always work, and the game likes to troll you. I think we're here. Night Lily Seeds. Anyway. Into the bar tactics we go. A toast in honor of Asbel Lunt's promotion and the start of a long and glorious career. May the wind guide our blades. May the wind guide our blades. Thank you, Captain. I hope to continue training under you even after I become a knight. Relax, Asbel. This is a celebration. Let tomorrow take care of itself. Being a knight is all I ever wanted. I need it, Captain. I need to be strong. Nothing good can come from haste, Asbel. When I left home, I swore to become strong. I swore I would never again fail to protect someone. So when I'm not training or fighting, I feel like I'm wasting time. Seeking the strength to help others, eh? It's a noble goal, and if becoming a knight helps you achieve it, then so much the better. But there are some things even a knight cannot protect. You would do well to remember that. Understood, sir. All right, enough wool gathering. This is your celebration, so eat up. Yes, sir. Whew! Thanks for the meal, Captain. But I can't eat another bite. Good. Now well, maybe next time we'll celebrate your entry into adulthood with my favorite cocktail. Come. We should return to the Knight Academy. All right, we're back. I'm gonna go ahead and <clears throat> go back to the Night Academy. Cause you know, that's what we need to do. If I'm correct, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, anyway. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and get some equipment. That's what I want. Uh, <laughs> and second thought, there is nothing here. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Okay, I cannot believe I just referenced The Simpsons. Well, anyway. So, back to the Night Academy we go. And I know exactly where it is because it's just right in front of her. I'm an idiot. I am definitely an idiot.
I definitely have gone the wrong way again. <laughs> I think the Night Academy actually is just over here. There we go. Okay. <laughs> anyway, into the Night Academy. Crazy! I haven't seen you in seven years. What are you doing here? When did you arrive? A little while ago. You should have told me. I could have picked you up. Didn't you get the letter? Letter? Your mother sent you a letter begging you to come home. Oh. Well, I was on a mission. I haven't been here for a while. Wait a minute. Did something happen? Lord Aston passed away. <gasps> what? You mean to tell me that my father is gone? What are you talking about? <laughs> what happened? Calm down, Asbel. You're Sharia, right? Let's talk about this inside. Please, both of you follow me. Asbel, pull yourself together, all right? My father... Dead? The border dispute between Lant and Fendel has turned desperate. Your father is having difficulty coping with the situation. Please come home before the fighting takes an even more serious turn. I had no idea things were so bad. We waited to hear from you, but then Lord Aston perished in battle. With Lady Carey bedridden from exhaustion and grief, it fell to me to track you down. Captain Malik, I've also been entrusted with a message for the Knights. Will you hear it? Lot humbly requests the assistance of His Majesty's Royal Knights in her struggle against tyranny. The domains of Windor hold great autonomy compared to other nations. They're independent states in all but name. This makes it difficult for the Knights to intervene in disputes. I see the right of your cause, but things may be difficult. My grandfather said much the same thing. It seems we can only pray the dispute does not escalate into all-out war. I will speak with the other Knights, but I make no guarantees. This is a matter most grave, and perhaps they'll feel differently upon hearing the full story. We are in your debt, Captain. Asbel? Sir? I trust you to be the Knight's eyes and ears in this matter. Return to your home and assess the situation. We need to understand what's really happening. You'll also want to pay respects to your father and look in on Lady Carey. She needs you now more than ever. Go to her and give her what comfort you can. Understood. I must return to Lant as well. Then you and Asbel should travel together. Send word if you need any assistance, and I'll let you know if I learn anything on my side as well. Alright. As you can see, we've, uh... Got a very tragic message. <laughs> There's really nothing else I can say about that. But aside from all that, I will see you guys next time for another episode of Tales of Graces F. And we will go ahead and find out what's going on in Lump. I will see you next time, guys. You guys have yourself.